every time I put it upright, I will now go get the salt and see that we are spoon chop. We are spoon chop. everyone welcome to another episode of pum pum 101 uh, my name is Colleen Diedrich and the amazing goddess sitting right next to me is none other than Ramona Riley now today we will be taking uh, your questions right on uh, the conversation we've been having for the last two weeks which is all things to pleasure the mind yeah so ladies this is your opportunity to pipe up ask your questions and so on if there is anything that we touch on that you're curious about and you'd like for us to expand on now is the opportunity to do so we're going to ask you kindly to put your questions in all caps so we can see it seen <laughs> so type up the things then nice and big so we can see them we see everybody joining at this point welcome 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 pum pum 101 is now in full force so question time Hockey, we are talking about which question you have. Is there anything that we mentioned that you're curious about? Anything that you would like for us to expound on? Now is your opportunity to ask. Now remember, all caps, type in all caps so we can see what it is that um, you know, you're curious about. Hi guys. Unt night, night. Un until we start getting some questions, we can do a little quick recap mm -hmm. um, on you know, cocky we say. You know, in terms of making sure that we're pleasing the man that it is that we like or is attracted to or love or whatever that is. Mm -hmm. um, we touched a lot of different things in terms of foreplay, in terms of while penetration is happening and how to tease him and, and stimulate him in other ways that he might like and doesn't say or that he might not even know that he likes. Um, but being exposed to it, you know, his reaction is positive. So... I know a lot of women um, sometimes have an issue with having sex with their mate on a regular basis. And this is a real thing. And your heart and your mind and your soul might want to please him, but you physically can't find it. May it be the energy, may it be the mental space, may it be to get it done and then another aspect of that could be because you're not being pleasured also so it's not as fun for you it is important for us at the end of the day to make sure that we are not just uh, expressing ourselves to them but we are also allowing them to be able to express and being open and free with the gentleman right when it is that you feel as if you don't want to or you can't bother or something you can't ignore that you need to tap into that you need to figure out what that is is that hormonal why you don't feel like doing it is there a connection issue between the two of you that you need to work on mm -hmm. because at the end of the day, I know that if I am not connecting with you, no matter how good you think you could be pleasing me, I could have liked it every other day, but today I don't like it. It is not getting me wet. Yeah. Um, and I know some women are like that. So sometimes it's really mental also. It's really hormonal. So look into that as well, women, please. Have we, has any questions come up so far? I saw something about vaginal tightness. This is Q's... Vaginal so tightness. Tell us what's going Somebody on here? Was asking about vaginal tightness. Um, vaginal tightness. So, mm -hmm. uh, when it comes to that, um, I hear a lot of people saying that you know they do vaginal steams because it tightens the vagina. Mm -hmm. The vaginal steam does not tighten the vagina. <laughs> Tightening the vi vagina is going to come with toning the muscles. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. making sure that the muscles are healthy, that the muscles are strong, that they are toned, so that they can be manipulated in any way. It is not necessarily that a tight pussy is a good pussy. Yeah. Okay. I know, especially in Jamaican culture, we talk about, talk about tight pussy and it and and it must a tight not even that tampon can fit and all that uh -huh. thing, right? <laughs> It is not about being tight because tight is not necessarily good either. It's going to, the man is going to feel like he has on a condom even though he doesn't have on a condom mm -hmm. because it's so tight. What is important is if your um, muscles are toned, right, mm -hmm. then 
you can tighten where you want to tighten and loosen where you want to loosen and that is where the the skill and the way to manipulate is um is available right and you can do that it's not gonna work like that i need the pen it's not here it's not gonna go mm -hmm. um so yes yeah, so in terms of tightening you can definitely tighten your vagina um there are lots of different muscles exercises that you can do um and if you are interested in that you can definitely try out the class on the 27th uh where we will be doing different types of exercises that you can practice at home just so that you can tighten and tone those muscles any other questions so far okay if i don't have sex often like twice a year boy does that affect my vagina Merciful father, baby, the man they're foreign. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> <laughs> I hope he's somewhere else. <laughs> I, twice a year. Ooh, twice a year? Oh my goodness. I don't think that affects so, the vagina. What do you right. think? So here is so here is here here is my take on it, sweetheart. The fact that um you are not having penile penetration as in man body reaching the pom pom does not necessarily mean that you cannot still stimulate yourself, okay? So what I would suggest is that um you masturbate, you buy yourself some toys, you get that pussy active don't just sit there waiting on penis to make it happen i don't know that it affects the vagina i've never actually heard of mm -mm. anything medical or otherwise that would suggest that it affects the vagina if it is that you are inactive no for we would have dead dead friendly no and the pump would have dry up so no such thing my thing is to say continue to masturbate continue to stimulate yourself orgasms yeah. are important there you go. no matter how very, you get them very 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 that is important the issue. for the vagina <laughs> yes it, that keeps the vagina young. that is what that, that is what we the need. vagina healthy and so on but and circulation is, and all these things no 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 absolutely so you definitely masturbate sweetheart put some self-love on it and don't wait for for, for real real body body can buy in a store I'm just like i said all right mm. hold on i have seen is this what is it good for the vagina is alum fire bun pan them loose business about is alum good for the vagina no honey no 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 it's something that i hear a lot of people i know i see it inhale and exhale <laughs> <laughs> no nobody now use alum again then there's something that wouldn't have my granny time out so you know no you're assault your pum pum with them things there come your mother and tell them no, man i don't know no. what is going on all boric acid the rat no. poison people are putting them vagina i was not good for um Yeast, what? yeast infection. My girl, that is madness. Yes, so it's the boric, with, with, it's the boric with, acid. With chronic, my girl, that is madness. There are other ways. There are other ways. <laughs> Please to, don't to get it do that. There are other ways. What is this question right here? It affects is positive. It's, what is born again virgin? No, baby, mm -hmm. no. You don't want to be a born again virgin. No. That is overrated. Please, so many thanks. women did not even enjoy their first or their second time. Oh, good. What is this now? Men are too sensitive. sensitive. Toys, Toys are, are good. <laughs> Yeah, and some Toys women don't need that touch. They are, they don't need it. Where mm -hmm. some women are like, oh, I need to feel someone connected to me. I need to kiss. I need to do all these other things. Mm -hmm. Okay, somebody said, I'll get another body. Um, yeah, that's I always mean, that's option. always an option. I mean, always body out there like fish may in I a sea. You, may I tell you, for stone dog. Okay, remember what we were saying. Please put your questions in all caps. Okay, what is alum though? Somebody wants to know. Out of the night, the way from the real body, <laughs> body can buy a store. <laughs> but there you go, Colleen said it already. <laughs> you don't have to get nobody. <laughs> All right, so hold on. Somebody was asking, What is alone? Like, I can't, I don't know. I, I know, I have no idea. I know it's something, at least I used to hear about it, right? That is something <laughs> I think it's made from herbs. Mm. I am not certain, so don't quote me on this. That the woman can insert into the pum pum, and apparently, it makes the pum pum super tight. I don't know that it is healthy for the pum pum. And what I would suggest in nowadays, big, big 2020, and so on, I'm gonna need alum again, right? Oh, <laughs> fireball. No, no. Just do yeah. your exercises. Yes, see, some kegels. Buy yourself a goddamn yoni egg. Let me show you what it looks like. <laughs> We've been talking about yoni eggs and so on. No joke. This is weight for the pum pum. This is heaven. This is all you need for the pum pum. And do Every your exercises, time, all the time, squeeze, you squeeze, insert release. this into the pum pum. Believe you me, and squeeze and release, squeeze and release, and you'll be surprised how it strengthens out the, the, the crutches. Yes, yeah. right here. Not a message. You yet. are so right, my darling. Okay, somebody's asking, what is that? Hold on, let me see. Wait, wait, wait. 
going to get that off of here. Um, it affects hold on. Guys, sorry, you hear I'm trying to find the question. Please save your life, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we're going to save it. Um, but don't know about what it looks like. Okay, I don't know what it looks like either. What, what is considered a good, good pussy? pussy? Mm -hmm. You can All go right. ahead first. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good pussy. Good, good pussy is one that is responsive. Yeah? One that is responsive to um, stimuli. And by stimuli, I mean whatever it is that, that, that is attempting to create arousal, right? Outside of that, good pussy is one that has control. That's the reason why we're talking about the importance of your Kegels, mm -hmm. um, the exercises that you need to do in order to strengthen the pum pum. You know, for the moms and so on, after you have baby, especially if it is that you have the child vaginally, then you will notice that the muscles aren't as tight as they used to be. Please, please understand. I know it can come right back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good, nice and juicy and gummy, same way. Or you metal. Just, there you go you just need to start to practice yeah so the woman who has control over that pussy that is good pussy as Ramona rightly said you don't need any to say what she mean by yourself you don't need you don't the pussy don't have to tight 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 like vice mm. that that's annoying and most men will tell you them can't they don't enjoy that. it no and she's not going to enjoy it because no. if your pussy is that tight then it hurts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not feel good. So you want you want one that the woman has control over. When she can ripple it and dance it and support the man of I wonder what the hell is happening in there. And what is next? There you go. And it's wet. Mm -hmm. Jesus. And more and, and, and warm. Mm -hmm. And then it's grippy. Yep. Good for your tummy. Mm. Yummy, yummy, yummy. That's some good pussy right there. How okay. You take out and look yoni egg. Oh. Okay, so you squat, mm -hmm. you can, okay, so they have two types of yoni eggs. You have the drilled and you have the non-drilled. The non-drill would mean that you would have to squat to remove your yoni egg. Non-drill. So this is a non-drill. There are no, no holes, holes up in here. Okay, there are no holes. No holes in So here. it's completely solid. Mm -hmm. Whereas... Hold on, okay, you have a drilled one? All right, she's looking for a drilled one. Okay, so the non drill, no holes in there. The other ones are drilled. Yeah, so the, the so the ones that are drilled mm -hmm. are drilled up at the top, up here, and there are two holes. Mm. And usually, uh, I sell it with um, a string. honey and oh. beeswax string. Mm -hmm. And so you can tie it. You put it in. When it's time to come out, you pull it out like you would a condom. You throw away the string. You clean your egg. You keep it moving. Mm. I personally don't like to recommend the drilled stones to my clients unless they have a problem like they can't even touch their vagina, which there are women out there that have that from trauma or whatever else, how they've been conditioned. Mm -hmm. But in general, I prefer to not to have it non-drilled. Mm -hmm. It allows you to be able to get to know your vagina more. It is easier to have sex with when you do in terms of the holes, not necessarily creating an issue vaginally inside. Um, as I said, it's easier to clean it. Um, mm -hmm. and yeah, so it really just depends. It depends on where you are, who you are, you know, um, what you've been through, what you're comfortable with. But usually a yoni egg, you sit on the toilet or you squat or any, any kind of sitting position and you birth your egg. You literally birth, birth your egg. Push it it crowns yep. and then it releases. You feel it coming down. You feel it coming down. And coming down. Squat down. Yeah. I you naturally I want to do that. Squat down and deep breathe. The breath literally pulls, push it right down, so you don't have to worry. Not when going there and get stuck. And a lot, None and a lot of, and a, a, can you get a, you want egg? Hold on. Oh, okay. a lot of, a lot of women also need to understand that when you put this yoni egg inside of you, you'd be surprised that it's going to probably be dropping out before you even want it to drop out. Okay, you won't even be ready um, because your muscles aren't toned. So it just auto and it and it's slippery. So it just automatically just comes down after you've walked around for fifteen minutes. So once you put it in, really try to make sure you're at home. You have on a full underwear, something like that, so that you can know how your body's reacting. I always say the best thing to do is put your yoni egg in before bed, do your exercises, and go to sleep. It stays in there longer when you twist and turn and stretch and do all of lean to roll to the side and roll to the other side. Your vagina is, your muscles are being toned and you're not even squeezing your vagina. Mm. Okay. So that's a really good place to start. If it is that once you put it in, it comes out immediately. All right. So I'll tell you a little bit about my, um, okay. Um, Don't you have this one? I have a 
clear crystal. No, no, this one, this one. It's not the pink quartz? No, it's the clear quartz? Pink, mine is the clear quartz, right? Oh, this, this is one. mine. This is what mine looks like. So let me show you. Mine is a little bit bigger, and it looks like this. Now, the thing is, what I do is that I actually push it in. Ramona said something that was noteworthy just now, right? The thing is, some women will push this thing inside the pum pum and it jump right back out. And you're thinking to yourself, Jesus Christ, no pussy big. That is not the case. Please <laughs> note, it's not the case. No matter the truth mm -hmm. of God, love. Don't frighten. As she rightly said, sometimes your muscles don't have that kind of control. So it pushes right out. Not to mention it is very, very smooth. I don't know if you can see it properly, but extremely smooth. Now, the other thing to notice about yoni eggs is that they're made from semi-precious stones. So not only are they toning the vagina, they, they have some weird pandemic, they're heavy, mm -hmm. right? Not only are they toning the vagina, but also energetically what it's resetting in your system. And each one of them carries different energy that is amazingly good for you yes yeah, so and this whole idea of sleeping with it in the night and so amazing especially for those of us who don't know how to manipulate the pum pum just yet with, once you get to it though you can walk around in the house jump up and down me go, go to the gym exactly go, go shopping me go to the gym everything would fit me on perfectly fine oh when you go to the gym there are certain exercises that you're doing that hip thrust and whatever else that tightening up the pum pum mm -hmm. can done mm -hmm. so you definitely want to try yoni egg for those who are asking we are by cosmic woman so you can get it by ramona's place she has them you know they're amazing assortment of them all kinds Check of different bio. types and whatever else different colors so you choose which one that speaks to you yeah yeah definitely what you're drawn to if exactly. you have to be drawn to it you have to think it's attractive right. um for those who are in jamaica yeah you can come down to the office or you can just dm us we can send you what we have you can choose what you want uh if you want to order online you can do that as well yes, exactly. mm -hmm. if you have questions about it dm us you know if you have other questions all right so somebody's asking okay um she's heard about the the different effects of the stones and whatever as always see people talk about the jade egg what is this what is special about the jade stone specifically for the vagina the jade stone is a reproductive and heart stone mm -hmm. so as colleen was talking before energetically um emotionally uh, the egg heals different aspects of us. So if, for example, you have been through trauma or you have been through neglect mm -hmm. or you have been hurt by men or you have something with that heart aspect, right. a jade egg would be able to help you. Mm -hmm. If you have reproductive issues, may it be fertility, may it be painful periods, may it be anything reproductive, the jade egg would also help. Jade is also great too because it has that aspect of money as well. Yes. Um, and so you are drawing that and, and creating law of attraction, I guess you could say almost. Um, so Jade Egg is one of the more popular ones. Jade Egg is actually my most expensive stone that I have. Um, but don't just get Jade just because you think you're supposed to get Jade. Like either be really attracted to the stone Oh. Or mm -hmm. look up different stones in terms of what it is you're trying to accomplish. Are right. you trying to get your mind and your focus and your memory right? Are you trying to heal your reproductive system? Are you trying to balance your life and create like grounding? Are you All trying of to these... get over a lover? Right. right. All oh. of these things make a difference. And then of course, what's great about Yoni eggs is that you can have sex with them. And having sex with Yoni eggs are fantastic. However, let's put in a caveat right there amazing stuff when you're having sex with it however it's something that you want to think about you don't casual sex with a yoni no. egg okay that ain't for the bloke you just met the tall drink of, of mm -hmm. chocolate mm -hmm. down the road that's it, that you don't need that to the, no please mm -hmm. Antons. that is for your good good man yep the man where you want in your life and them something there and them man that you have the yoni egg sex with you got what i mean the man you'd want to have a, his child or something there you like go. that it creates an amazing connection an amazing synergy between both of you so you want to you want to think twice before yes. you actually have the sex. Somebody said, peace and blessings, queens. Hi, Mr. Caribbean Fitness. Um, love the topic. Speaking from a male's perspective, good pussy for me is great chemistry. I don't care how good you think this pussy is. If there is no chemistry, then hell fuck yes, baby. I agree. Good chemistry is everything. I agree. Absolutely amazing. But not all men will, will say that, though. Mm -hmm. No, no. They're not all men are that tight, baby. Yeah. Tight, 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 to, it has to be a porno, porno kind of vibe. Hey, you know? I love that. Yep. 
hold on so i'm checking to see okay yes ramona sells the yoni eggs you can get them here at her office where is your office ramona? 10 argyle road kingston 10, 10 argyle road where of when you open, lady musgrave when you open good girl 9 a.m to 4 p.m monday to a friday see that see that's our own come by the pum pum weights ladies <laughs> Get it sorted out. Hold on. We're looking for the questions. Remember, I'm asking, please, if you can put them in all caps so we can see it. What's the average cost of the eggs? Okay. Um, they run from twelve five, um, and they go up to fifteen five. So it just depends on the egg. The fifteen five is the jade. Um, the cheaper eggs are usually black obsidian, snowflake obsidian, um, mahogany jasper. Um, those types of things. Um, and then the most expensive one is the jade. Mm. All right. Here this snow. Somebody said me and my man is funny in bed. But right after he falls asleep. Right after. Jesus. As in Papa off in the sleep. Oh, God. Boy, I'm just, I anyway, anyway, even if I am not done. No, sir. Oh, wow. What are you talking about? How can I draw out the sex so he does not go to sleep? No, girl. Wow. And what I want right here, so now. All right, so see that? You want you want to take that? Go ahead. All right, so here, so here is what I'm going to suggest. You want to get your cum first. <laughs> if he's that, if he's no, like that, no, no, he's no, not going to talk to you because here this now. If the man going to drop asleep after him come fire, bun, gun, shot and everything, bless up your good, good man, see that, but no, no, he must understand himself. You want to get your cum first. You don't need to draw out the four pair or whatever, just sit down on the man's face. Make sure you get yours first. However it is that you are gazing, Whatever make sure works that for you, make sure that happens first. So by the time him pop off, everybody's satisfied, mm -hmm. you're good to go. And have a conversation though. Find out what's happening. I'm, I'm curious, have you spoken to him about it? Have you told him how it makes you feel? Talk to him and I'll find out what's going on there. Okay, so does the egg help with making the vagina ripple? Shoot. Um, yes, it has to, of course. We're toning the muscles. So in toning the muscles, you're able to then control the muscles. So you would not be able to ripple your vagina muscles if mm -hmm. your muscles are not strong. Yes. For example, um, you can put a tampon in your vagina. Some women can take their vagina muscles and they can push out that tampon. Mm. Okay, mm. great. Some, some mm. women can't mm -hmm. do that mm -hmm. right and it's because their muscles are not as toned mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. so when you can ripple it means your muscles are crazy toned healthy chung <laughs> all of it <laughs> <laughs> so entrepreneur till the end i've been looked up for i've been locked up sorry for two years i want to save my build up for the right woman what do you suggest are you masturbating? Is he masturbating? It's just that he's not having sex? He's not having sex. But but he could be masturbating or he's not doing nothing. I don't know. I hope he I hope he answers. Go on tell him. Go on talk to him. Because if, if it is if it is that you are masturbating and you're waiting to have the sex with someone that it makes sense or whatever, I completely understand that. Completely. Women do that shit all the time. But if you are not masturbating and you are not having sex and you're waiting on this ah woman to come for you to do that, um, that's gonna that that's not healthy. It's not healthy for your penis. It's not healthy for your circulatory system. It's not healthy for your prostate. It's not healthy for for nothing. <laughs> Here, here's what I would also suggest: masturbate because it, it helps to build up control. The thing is, if you have been without pum pum for the last two years, sweetheart, just the sight of the crutches, you take off the jaws and you pop off. You understand? <laughs> yeah. So you want, you want, abstinence. you want abstinence. Abstinence is amazing, absolutely amazing. And I would suggest every man, every woman at some point in your life must consciously make that decision to abstain, to do the celibacy walk. It's amazing. It does great things for you. But gentlemen, sir, I would suggest that you masturbate um, periodically because it teaches you control. So by the time you actually get this woman, you know, I mean, your stamina game up. You can you can manage the pump pump. Yeah. Okay. So somebody says, suppose him don't wait. What? I'm tired. Like, suppose, suppose the man don't eat pump pump. Sweetheart. What? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not we don't have sure. No, no, no. No. We're not com why, we don't why, understand comprehend. Why are you there with man that don't eat pum pum? No comprehend. Pum no, no, sweetheart. <laughs> he must eat at the pum pum. Period. Full stop. And Amen. Black. Amen. Crunch and munch. Crunch and munch. Wine and dine. Hold on, you're so waiting on time. I'm waiting on thing there to give it to me. Okay, she needs a white name there. The um the stylist. 
to, 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 to make the Somebody was saying, where mm -hmm. can I get a yoni egg? Okay, so you can pick up a yoni egg by Ramona's place. That's Cosmic Woman. That's 10 Argyle Avenue or Road? Road. road. 10, 10 Argyle Road. road. Please don't tell me. Right. Bar Avenue. So our our Bray, off Braemar Avenue, mm -hmm. right? You can pick up your um, you can pick it up there. Okay, hello. Or or you can order it online at cosmicwoman.com. Mm -hmm. Yes, because I said that again because somebody was asking about. You that. can go um, if you're not in Jamaica, you can go to www.cosmicwoman.com mm -hmm. and you can place your order. Um, I would suggest you get a medium egg. Um, I suggest most women to get a medium egg unless they're either a virgin um or yeah pretty much all right much. somebody Sex. say them husband don't eat pum pum wow them did you know this before <laughs> oh my lord i see that let me let me explain now to whomever <laughs> this person is i teach that class okay so when so my next him. couple's class my next couple's workshop look out for that bring the gentleman Bring him come and are we you, that no, let me start that out for you. Don't Yo. don't you worry now, sister. Wow. Yo, Jordi no, and Nell, Jordi and Nell, mm -hmm. she says, teach whoever said that they don't have pum pum, the man them man on them pum pum. She should leave the class. Oh Jesus. <laughs> anyway, hold on. Sex with the um sex with the egg, how does it affect the uterus? Um, it does not affect the uterus in a negative way. It actually strengthens the pelvic floor, which mm. is the whole reason why. Mm -hmm. So we always talk about the vagina muscles and the toning of the vagina muscles and all that, and that's all great and dandy. But we also have to think about the pelvic floor. The pelvic floor, the man has one, the woman has one. Mm -hmm. A lot of times when we have children, the pelvic floor weakens. If you've never had a child, the pelvic floor weakens. Right. If you lift too much heavy weights and the way you, you, you position your body, that also can create... Um, um, damage to the pelvic floor as well so the pelvic floor is always going to be strengthened when we're strengthening the actual muscles of the vagina it goes hand in hand mm -hmm. uh, in terms of having sex with it when you have sex with the yoni egg it creates new spots there it, it, it's almost like I don't know but for I don't know how many women um, will agree with me on this but sometimes you can have sex with a man and you find a new spot. It's like he's he never been. Feeling, yes, it's never way. been there before. Mm -hmm. This feel new. This feel nice. Don't move. Don't stop. Keep doing what you're doing. Yes, right there. The yoni egg creates that mm -hmm. because when it is inside of the vagina and the penis is thrusting, what happens is there is a there is a vibration that is created in the yoni egg because of the thrust. And that vibration stimulates that part of the vagina. So the next time you have sex or the time after that that you have sex, you're going to find that there are new spots that you're finding that you didn't know were there before. So it's almost like it awakens it. Mm. So yeah, having sex with the yoni egg is awesome. All right. Okay, so Chrissy is asking, she says, my husband and I have zero sexual chemistry. I have I have dreams of having sex with other men, but I don't desire my husband at all. What do I do? All right, so let me let me jump in right there, um, Chrissy. Honey, I, I, I feel your pain. There are a million questions that's running in my mind automatically because I'm wondering if this happened over a period of time, if there was some kind of breaking down in the marriage at some point, is there some resentment that is carrying whatever else on your side? Now, in the absence of those answers, what I will say is this, the fact that there is no chemistry don't mean say it, that this is the way that it has to be forever and ever, amen. Truth is, is that chemistry is something that you can develop, yeah? It is going to take relearning this person, getting, getting back in into, into um, the face and spending more time and so on. But before you embark on that journey, you need to ask yourself the million dollar question. Am I still emotionally here? Am I still emotionally invested? Is this a relationship that I want to continue? Because any all your answer is no funny, then you could have tried little more, nothing is not going to happen. Mm -mm. You want to make sure that this, this person, I still love this person, I'm still emotionally invested, I still want this relationship to work. And then, and only then, can you guys actively start working on it? Have a conversation with him. Tell him the things that you are desirous of at this point, and together, both of you work on it. Find out what's going on with him. Are you still stimulating him? Are you still doing it for him, right? And if that is the case, then you are good to go. You guys can embark on this journey. This idea of relearning each other can be a phenomenal task. So what I'm saying is answer that first question. Do I still want this man? Do I still love this man? 
do I still want to journey with him? Answer that. I also think this is a good example to bring awareness to women that when we are going to decide that we're going to spend the rest of our life with someone mm, mm. it is not about the sex mm. don't get me wrong it is not where you have to marry the, the best sex you've ever had no that's not what i'm saying it's important but though. you do have to have that sexual chemistry mm -hmm. because even if we're talking about forever you have to be able to know that through the storms through the this through the that it's still going to be good mm. right when it is that the sex is not good, on top of all the other issues that we can have in marriages, because of course we know marriages are hard and rough, mm -hmm. right? Um, this is now another issue. It's almost like a woman who knows say, she like when our man spend money on her and then go on trip and then re 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 and, and then she ends up getting pregnant and marrying a man that can't do that. <laughs> How that work? Yeah. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like you have to be honest with yourself mm -hmm. or maybe what it is, is at the end of the day, maybe you have to be honest with the partner as Colleen is saying and kind of let them know from the get go. Don't wait until I'm married from the sex was not right. Talk about it. We've Thank been talking you. about this from the get go mm -hmm. from um, foreplay. Mm -hmm. Talk about what was not done right. What was done right. And it doesn't have to be a school setting where you're like, I need you to do this, don't do that. Here's it can be it can be any kind of way. You can do it in a sexual way. It can be while you're having sex. It can be over dinner. It can be write a letter. You could have sing a song. <laughs> it don't blood clot matter. Just express it. It One has time. to be expressed. The thing too is that um, we have to be cognizant of the facts. So listen to me. Our appetite change. So what used to excite you in your twenties might not do it for you in your forties. You get mm -hmm. what I mean? So and a woman when she reaches her forties, I can't wait. Jump out of my skin, my girl. I can't I can wait. tell you. I can tell you about it. Forty-five here, and that much I, libido is through the roof. Yes. I, want, I don't know if I need my I libido to be, to be any more no, through my the roof. Girl, <laughs> At this point, what I'm saying is this. You want to be engaged in a different way. So apart, we have to understand. There are two things that we need to pay attention to as it pertains to chemistry. Every relationship experience a love. This thing here, some relationships are fortunate enough that the chemistry, are, even when they're not cussing and they can't stand each other, the chemistry always lack. Is what I said? But there are some relationships, depending on the state of the finances, depending on the picking in them and the mortgage and all of the oh, things that we are pressure on or whatever else, the chemistry just get a beaten. That is fine. It's not an indication that the relationship done. You understand what I mean? Mm -hmm. When it can work on it, see and we are so on. So I just need for us to be cognizant of that. And a movie we are dealing with. This is real fucking life, yeah? And in real life, shit goes up and down, sideways, cross we are so on. I just want them to take that. Which is why sometimes you just need to spice it up. You just need to do yes. something different. So maybe it is that they don't satisfy you penetrational wise mm -hmm. or they don't mm -hmm. eat your pussy or whatever the case is. Then... Make it be that they do something else that could be important to you, mm. or you can spice it up a different type of way, even if it's something that you guys have never it's done. Mm. So maybe he doesn't sexually thrust well, but maybe if you guys were to go outside and fuck, maybe the thrust the thrust is nicer because they of the scenery it. and the fact mm -hmm. that you're there and you shouldn't be outside having sex. Yeah, shouldn't be. No, that, that, how that increases, yes, that heightens it. yes, it the heightens. Fact, it. Could I get must. catch and so Yeah, that's the guys. I hope you are recognizing everything that we have been talking about, since and it we comes started. back down. Oh, everything Come, come around back you know you understand what i mean sexual chemistry is something that can build active it's going to take active participation and real real work and intention to get it to happen hold on let me see there's another question do i have do i have to use a special what is this cleaning of the uni egg or is it good to go buy as me buy it no good you can't no you have to clean it you have, to, you have to clean it and you have to set your intentions. And this is a whole other aspect as well. Right? Guys, please. When you get your yoni egg, I don't care if you cleaned it. You cannot put it in immediately. Okay? This is going to be another branch of you. And just like how you get a fish... And when you get the fish, you have to leave the fish in the water, in a one next, in a the actual bowl that you're going to leave it in for a little while for it to adapt and, and balance out. It's the same thing with the yoni egg. Mm -hmm. So once you get it, it's about setting your intentions. There is a yoni, there is, when it comes to like your new moon and your full moons mm -hmm. and your, all of these things, you set what you want to get from this egg. Absolutely. You have chosen this egg. This egg is good for this, 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 and, and this. this. 
you're going to say it, say it out loud, say it to yourself, whatever the case is. You know, I set this intention that I will get whatever. Mm -hmm. I will get um, sexual stimulation. Um, I will become pregnant. I will, what the hell ever, have multiple orgasms. Mm. And in setting these um, intentions, what happens is you use your yoni egg, use your yoni, and you will find that your, intent, your intentions manifest. And when they manifest, that is when you go to a new yoni egg. Mm. Because now you've healed that All the things. and now we're going to the next thing. Right, right, right. Okay, question from Forever Miss Sandals. I'm going through menopause and I can't get enough. Can the yoni egg help with those insatiable desires? Mm. Mm. What a question. Forever Miss Sandals. Okay, so when it comes to when it comes to menopause, okay, or pre-menopause, a lot of times it is the lack of libido that is usually the it issue. Is. Mm -hmm. It is not the fact that you want it and crave it. So the fact that that's the case, that's awesome. That's actually beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, as a matter of fact, are you that's sure? Are you sure you're going through menopause? She can't, she can't get enough. Yeah, she are you so sure so you can't get enough? Yeah. Are you sure, <laughs> Miss Miss Sonia? Are you sure, Miss Sonia? Are you sure? <laughs> Um, no, it's, 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 it's great. It's great that you're in that position and that you want it and you crave it and you need it. And if you need one person to give that to you and you can find that one person that can satisfy that, great. If you need two, if you need 10, if you need a woman, if you need whatever, Have if you a need a group, whatever it is, which you do what it is that, that you need to do, you. what works for you guys. Yeah. But you have to be honest with yourself mm -hmm. and you cannot, and give to yourself. If you want sex five times a day. And you are not getting it five times a day. Jesus. Then wow. a conversation needs to be had. Mm -hmm. Or you need to date a kind of man that wants to fuck five times a day too. The other thing too is this, you know, bear in mind that you have the option of supplementing with toys. So if your husband or your man cannot deliver the five, six times for the day, how do you buy yourself a bullet though? Five minutes in the bathroom of the people that work and stuff for can't reset bullet, your bullet, life. Bullet. Oh, you understand what I'm trying to say? I mean, I'm just saying, you don't have to get, you don't have to pressure the little man and the little body and so on all the time. If another am not the man thing there, I'm not the man thing there. I'm saying, sort your goddamn self out. Let us get more proactive about our sex and so on. You understand what I mean? The next thing too is have the conversation as Ramona just said. Again, as I said, we are constantly evolving. So talk to your partner if you need something else. Communication in, is the in key. Communication is the key so you don't have to sit there in frustration and then I bind up your leg and so forth. Options are available. And your pussy, you, you, you pussy are jump and you just are try to ignore it like it not jump. Come on, no, Bitch, honey. it's jumping. I, I do something can you do? That can shit. you, can you touch her? Please can you love fans, on her? Please. Don't just, to, don't just make it go like so. I'm going to need you to do that. Every day is not honeymoon, okay? Yes, okay. Can be the best sex of your life. And the man is, what is this? A living crosses. Honey, let me tell you something. <laughs> Hear this now. Hear this now. Let me tell you something. Don't make body tie now. You know me, watch yourself on your scene. No, no me dead serious. Don't make body tie now. You understand what I'm trying to say? And you never notice a little crosses, man. Them have the good fucking up. Fire one, <laughs> fire them, man. Jesus. Anyway, don't make body. Don't make body time. That is all I'm going to say. Make good no sense comment. prevail. Yes. Make good sense prevail in all things. Because guess what? If you fall but into a cycle, you I'm telling you, fall into a cycle at the end of the day, you feel like shit. I am saying, sweetheart, you can go sort out yourself. There comes a point at which good sense must prevail and you decide, I am worth more than this. You work more than this, what, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 30 minutes, what a slap, my girl. Feel for this try your life over cross. Mm -hmm. no slap. TC a no. red Bennett say, why not? Why body enough a time? Why body enough a time? Let me tell no, you. No, you need to have control of your own thing. It is not that, <laughs> yeah. it's not the body can't good and you can't love it and you can't hope that it stays and you guys keep all of what is good. But you cannot make it hypnotize you not and so. turn you into an idiot. Mm -mm. No, when you start to lose your priorities and lose you, self, exactly when you start to lose self. And the thing is, this you know, when you're under the cocky, is a different story. Now, Jesus, no, Christ, you can't turn it into an You should right. turn into an idiot. When you come back to your senses and when you, you say to yourself, "The bomba clatter, what happened just a little while?" This money are real, real living, living crosses, my friend. No, <laughs> there is a point all the way. And if we are honest as women, there is a point that our one body did catch me. Some of we unfortunate six of them catch me a cocky fool. You understand what I mean? What cocky I'm saying fool. is cocky idiot. What cocky. I'm saying. Is, <laughs> what I'm saying is bring your life in order, sister. Bring your life in order. 
Exactly, me I said. No, sir. You carry a cocky fool, so what you mean? No, sir. 20 did a cocky fool, 30 a cocky fool, 40 a cocky fool, no, girl. No, we have the power. Get yes, your life yes, in order. Exactly, we have the power. Oh, we have Hello. the power. Good men. No. No. And no. Women, we need to realize no, no. that men, most men, not all men, but most men get up every day because of pussy. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. When he was 12, 13, 14, 20, 30, 40, 70. Subconsciously or consciously, he is doing a lot of what he's doing. Yes, because of self and motivation and love himself. But because also of pussy. <laughs> it, pussy is a motivation. Uh-huh. <laughs> And the reason man go buy the car, go walk, go see job and so on. So they can own and run certain, the pussy. Yes, get certain caliber pum pum. Yeah, and hold you it. understand? There you go. Yeah. Okay, so somebody have a question. How can you fix low libido? Hormones, <laughs> hormones, hormones, hormones. We have to balance the hormones. It's very important to balance the hormones. Um, we have a hormonal tea blend here at Cosmic Woman that really helps with that. Um, maybe if you want to even mix that with the womb tea blend as well, that will be like double niceness. Um, but low libido is always going to be a hormonal issue. So we have to fix the hormones. Um, I would say also maybe a little bit of detoxing might be great too. But vaginal toning or yoni toning, whatever word you want to use, really helps to create the want and the need for sex. Mm -hmm. I find that every single time once I have practiced or have done a class or something like that, I am horny. My, my, my panty seat is wet, <laughs> like wet, like leaking, bad, bad, bad. And, I, and I'm not, and when I'm done, I'm not going to have sex, so it's not, it's, I'm like, uh, whatever, right? Masturbate with I know, sometimes I do, See, and sometimes I don't. Do I ever make good wet pussy boys? Masturbate. Sometimes I do, and Jesus. sometimes I don't. Masturbate. <laughs> but, it will always help. That class always. <laughs> Patrice has never done that class and she don't end up being wet. Lying to me. <laughs> <laughs> Colleen did the class at hedonism. I mean no, so she didn't I know I know her podcast jump, seat did wet too. Jumping, jumping, you see okay. when she started the vaginal breathing. Let me tell you something. Now. You see when Ramona do her vaginal breathing class, people are not joke thing, you understand me? Definitely try. You see that vaginal breathing now when she said make it start to pull from the battery there? Oh god. You mess away. Oh my pum pum face said, oh god. Oh, what oh, is happening oh. in there, Jesus? You I know which one I love the most? What? I love the urethral one. Really? I love that urethral exercise. I think. No, I'm gonna take me try that one day yet. It's, we're going, yeah, to, have to, we're yeah. going to have to make it a date. We will. Alright, so somebody says, can yeast infections be treated without medication? Well, there has to be some kind of medication, but medication, it just depends. Colitis so, so for well. yes, so it, there you so go. for example, if you're having yeast, if you're having bacterial vaginosis. Um, Collodial Silva is always great. Mm -hmm. um, we at Cosmic Woman do 500 ppm, which is a very strong version. You can't just get that at the pharmacy or at the store. Um, that really helps. Mm -hmm. um, another, th another thing also is probiotics. If you suffer from yeast infections on a regular basis, it's your gut, my darling. Mm -hmm. So you have to get to the gut. So please um, get a probiotic. You want at least 100 billion cultures. 100 billion, not million, but billion cultures. And you can take that once a day or even twice a day if you want to throw it in your smoothie, pop the pill, um, make sure you look at the ingredients that there is no dairy, no nothing. The brand I personally use is called Renew. Um, so if you guys want to look into that, you can for sure. Okay, so somebody is asking, please reach a Pum Pum Eating Thing class. Sweetie, don't worry. Look out for the workshop. It is she coming, got you. It is coming very, Born very, heart. very That's soon. You hear me say, look at the the, the workshop is coming and I do this specifically for couples so look it normally them happen oh, private no. but on a lookout now I advertise that one in public on a lookout yes please note and whenever it is that you hear me send me going to heat up for the week when I go for my wellness week please understand and know oh, that is the time that on ought to make it there because me I teach all of my all workshop kind of them every what me said it in heart May I tell you, wicked. So when I want up, 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 up through the roof, yes, please. So listen now, just, just look, just look and see. Hold on, we're checking to see if there are any more questions. Okay, so I just went through my look and see now. My own, I just slide up all the way up. Everybody, I have them own a little thing in the thing. You know that, God. Conversations yeah. and so on. Hold on, let's see what's happening. Okay, 
All right, so we're checking to see if there are any questions. Just a reminder to send your questions in all caps so we can see them because it's it's hard to see them whenever you know all the conversation is taking place, okay? So send them in all caps. Okay? And guys, remember, as we were saying before, teasing because remember at the end of the day we really want we really want you guys to focus on the cocky we want you to focus on the body the penis the whatever the shark whatever the fuck you want to call it we want you to focus on that know how to give it love know how to treat it know how to stimulate it all of that because the more you know how to do that is the wetter you get you know mm -hmm. you wetter you get like like there are some <laughs> men that eat pussy and then come hot and then come Christ. They come. The sound of the woman I met. And how she's reacting. How she, oh God. And how it's almost mm -hmm. like she can't manage. And the man is like, what the fuck? Yup. Right? Well, that can happen for us too. Certainly. Sucking dick too. Sucking dick, dick does is that supposed to get no, you wet. Sucking dick does that for It's me. the whole point oh, of Jesus. sucking dick. Was, it when gets it, you wet. When you hear the sound when my mech and you feel him ass when it starts to get tight because you're sucking. Mm. And your mouth is getting more moist. So if your mouth is getting more moist, your pussy please. is getting more moist. Please note, please, please note. Please. Ladies, let me tell you something. The thing is this, right? When a man sees that you're completely and totally into him, if it is that you're sucking dick, if it is that you're pleasuring him, if it is that you're fucking him, when a man sees that you're completely into him, it changes the chemistry in that. In and that his sex. body, I am because it's tough. You pull something out of the man <laughs> that you're not going to normally get when him sees say, yo, this girl, I really love everything. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm yeah his get ego goes it. through the roof. And a man whose ego is through the roof will fuck you three different shades pink honey. And I mean, do some things to you that you never anticipated. So bring yeah. it. And that, bring and, it. I mean, that, I mean, that confidence that is built at that moment will allow him to do all, maybe even do things he's probably not usually doing. Just Absolutely. Because, just because he's all in the... You joy him out. Fully. You joy him out. Fully joy him out. Stacey Ann McKinley on IG says, can one have too much sex, especially a woman? Too much sex? What do you yeah, mean? No. 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 You'd have to, you'd have to. Oh, what's Stacey really? No, no, I don't that mess. No, no, no too much sex. You have to qualify no. the question, baby. You have to, yeah, well, you, you have mean? to like, explain like, that a little more. And what does like, too much sex mean? Exactly. Like, every two what, what, minutes? Because then, yeah, that's a little extra. Right, so just but, explain. Yeah. <laughs> explain, <laughs> explain so we can get some clarity. Um, do I need, okay, which one of you do I need to see for this? I have an issue achieving an orgasm from penetration. What do I do? Okay, Steve. so I think here, okay, so I think both of us might be able to assist I you think where, so. where, where that is concerned. Um, Miss Lady and the Yoni Egg, again, because it helps you to access different points in your vagina, and then I can help you just to find out if there's anything that's going on psychologically. Because sometimes it might be in your head, exactly. girl. You might be too in your head. There might be some trauma that we need to move beyond. There might be some, um, how it is that you were socialized. Mm -hmm. The past study teach, the, 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 the mama. mother, and then something there. <laughs> so, I, no, so I would need, no, 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 it's not, not even what I want. Not it's sorry, I'm really my girl. So I would need to talk to you about that. But Ramona could help you in terms of the toning. actual, the actual toning and so on. Separate and apart from that, the other aspect of my sensuality work is getting a woman in touch with her physical self yeah so we masturbating not me are you you are you, mm -hmm. are you <laughs> no 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 serious because you sure no, no, no. <laughs> to be clear no to be clear to be the clear no funny no we're gonna offer that service but uh, all right may i show you off a masturbator of you see the level beast how to get in touch with yourself and all of these things right so there have a conversation with both of us Right, and then we'll see. Um, yes, yeah, send us a DM do. about it, and Absolutely. we'll work it out. There you go. Some so we are, we are kill them. <laughs> All right, check for you only. You know, system. We are check for you. I'm thinking that it's this one. Yeah. 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 Oh, All okay. right. Okay. Check, check, check. The things I'm looking yeah. So what is the difference? Island cheap vibes, chic vibes. Sorry. Right. Um, from IG, she said, "What's the difference between squirting and pee?" Oh my God, really? they're they're completely different things. Really, I don't cheat. No, on. no, 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 completely, completely. Okay, so pee is coming from your urethra, right? You got you got some holes up underneath it. Tell someone then what is urethra, and then there is. <laughs> Urethra, urethra is that little canal, all right, that facilitates the passing of okay. urine, oh, of the piss. That is where the pee pee come out of, right? <laughs> that is not where you're squirting from. You are squirting from your vagina. 
from your vaginal canal, okay? There might be a little bit of urine in there, just a little smidgen, <laughs> but it's completely it different. Can't, it's, it never comes in not, like urine. It's, it's, it's negligible. What's negligible it amount or whatever else. It, it is, is almost, soft, it is smellless and it is tasteless. Which is why it is not urine. There you go, because urine have a taste, a flavor, it's so all. You feel like you want to pee. Well, yes. yes, you do. That's the sensation yes. that you get just before. Allow it to go on. Yes. If you are sport, bouncing on it, if he exactly. is behind you thrusting, if anything mm -hmm. is happening sexually, Jesus. and you feel like you want, want to piss, board. ladies, <laughs> tell us, pee. Tell the man to pull out so it can come, so you can so see you can the see flow. It. You can because see the you, flow. Because it will seem just like a, a vaginal mm -hmm. rush. Um, like like excretion, and not you will not get that squirting thing where it's like here, there, and everywhere. Right. Now let me also say, squirting thing is very wet, you know, and not a joke thing. Bed wet up. It is not a joke thing. Woo! So please, yes, get wet know up. that. No, so, the bed I forgot probably got change. The sheet I forgot change. <laughs> you probably never want to put on a sheet yet because I forgot dry out. Mm -hmm. It's just a reality. But yes, it is not pee. Okay, all right, so independent Shanteka says, Shanteka, <laughs> that's your name. Ah. What about nine orgasms per 24 hour period? Is that too much? No. What per about 24, or, per, yeah. per 24. So, what about a lot of orgasms every day? Or how is that too how much? Is she, is, she is, is that man, is that her, like, masturbation? She didn't say. She never specified. I mean, I don't think that it is too much, but I think that with, with having that and experiencing that and doing that, you have to understand that that is not the norm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so with you knowing that, that then, then, yeah, you can't expect um, that one taxing. man to do that. Mm -hmm. You will then need to be masturbating on a regular basis as well, mm -hmm. or doing something out of road or whatever. But to have one man be responsible to satisfy you nine, nine times orgasms. for the day, that's a tad bit much. The other thing too, I'm curious, um, because there is a physical condition that um, women can continuously be having orgasms and so on. So I'm curious, are you setting these orgasms into motion? Yeah. And then I'm also curious what's happening because sometimes we masturbate and so on. And what the fuck like money is because it's a means of distraction. So you don't want to have to face what it is that you're dealing with in your day to day. So you decide, so you're going to join it out. Yeah, yeah, come, come, come every 10 seconds. So I'm curious yeah. what is informing this behavior. Mm -hmm. True. Yeah? That is, that's, that's, that's where my head space is. Cause that could, it, it could be now an addiction. Absolutely. Which is what Colleen would definitely be able to help with and get mm -hmm. down to that. What What is causing that? It's from trauma, yep. it's from this socialization, whatever. There you go. So definitely, please link her about that. Mm -hmm. All right. So I want to thank you guys for your questions, right? It's time for us to wrap up. Can you believe how fast the time goes? It goes oh my fast. gosh. Right, I saw somebody ask me a question about fibroids. Mm -hmm. You can um, DM. Yeah, cosmic woman, and you then you, we can work out the vagina the, the, lady and so on. Can give you some more information. You can also D, DM her for the uni eggs and so on. You can get all of that good stuff here at Cosmic Woman. Separate and apart from that, if it is that you have some, you know, um, questions as it pertains to sensuality stuff. Um, you can definitely touch base with me as it pertains to emotional trauma, your relationship challenges, and so on. You can definitely DM me as well. Yeah. So Ramona was talking about a upcoming pum pum squeezy squeezy. Class. <laughs> which yes. One, which which one is this? Um, is we have Yoni toning class on the twenty seventh, which mm -hmm. is clearly for women. Um, it is a free class, so just register. Uh, send a WhatsApp message to the four zero six number eight seven six four zero six. Two seven six four, mm -hmm. uh, and we can you can you can register so that we can send you the link. Mm -hmm. We're also doing a pelvic strengthening class, and the for pelvic the strengthening women. class is for the men. Mm -hmm. Just like how women have to do kegels, it's important for men to do kegels. Yes. And so I teach different types of kegels for the men, certain different exercises, so that his penis can be even stronger, mm -hmm. so that he can be able to manipulate the penis even more. Mm -hmm. um, so yes, not nobody wants anything more than a penis that knows what the ah, fuck he's doing. I'm it's hard. Hard yeah. and it's strong you demand them with the big tough eh, 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 mm. and if it is not big no, then no, it is you... more of a reason <laughs> if, it tough, huh? if it is not big it is more of a reason to make it tough and to make it strong because you are ready not that you're you already don't have that on your side so you can get other things on your no it's a real thing it's a real thing oh, shit. Oh, no 
me no say me no oh, say no. my breast them no sort out all like some other woman breast was thing there so me no say my my oh, poo poo my parade I forgot so it's yeah so okay. I forgot all right so ladies um public class the public lap dance class will be starting back on july 5th just check out my page you will nice. see it so this is where we get to meet and is that so it's happening at south beach okay it's 4 p.m sunday you're going to need to get yourself a pair of knee pads you're going to get yourself a what? thong leotard and we want the stocking them ratchet we're going to rock out i mean we're starting <laughs> ratchet on <and> rat, <laughs> right so we're going to get in touch with our, our feminine side we're going to get in touch with our sensuality i'm separate and apart from that my dance class is not just you just shaking your body okay i'm showing you how it is that you can transfer this thing to trick out this sex hear that so you definitely have to make it a day just follow and seduce and you see him and seduce your lover how you can turn things up just with a dance yeah. and turn on yourself just with a dance mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you understand me it's a normal thing so look it is July 5th, which is a Sunday. If, if, if memory serves me correct, check out my page, Colleen D, or for Vida Unleashed on Facebook, and you'll be able to see it there. Um, yeah, so the classes for sure, you guys know the, free, the, two, the two free classes, 27th for the females, 25th for the males, it's on Zoom. Uh, anyone who is having an issue with coming um, with orgasms or mm -hmm. even painful sex, please try a vaginal steam mm -hmm. please try a vaginal steam mm -hmm. it really really helps even with my clients that suffer from painful periods and painful every day all day when they steam and have sex there is a sort of relaxation that is created and i guess because of the wetness and because of the warmth and because of all of that that's happening mm -hmm. it is much more enjoyable for her and of course it will definitely be enjoyable for him so please don't suffer with bad sex don't suffer with painful sex it's not no, worth it it's yeah, traumatic it. yeah. don't do it it's not worth it your pussy is going to be pissed and, and hold so and hold feelings Okay, so somebody is asking, how do I pay for the classes? All right, simply send a WhatsApp to 876-575-6733. Check out my page, Kaleen D, and you will see the information there. Once you send the WhatsApp, then um, you will get back information telling you what exactly you need for the class, where you pay, because you must pay before um, in order to register for the class, okay? So just send the information, and yes, there will be twerking. I never teach a class without teaching you how to jump that batty honey water. Hello? Please and thanks. So guys, thank you so much, so much for tuning in. It is always a pleasure um, to be with you guys on a Friday. We will be again together on Friday of next week. And we will definitely let you guys know what we'll be talking about. Mm -hmm. um, for those who are not following us on YouTube, please do so. You on YouTube are... Colleen Diedrich, my full name. C-A-L-E-E-N-D-I-E-D-R-I-C-K. Colleen Diedrich on YouTube. And I am Cosmic Woman on YouTube. Mm -hmm. So please check us out. If there's anyone you want to show um, this video or any of the other lives that we've done for Pum Pum 101, you can check our YouTube page or you can check our Instagram page. Who is following Colleen? Please follow me. Who is following me? Please follow Colleen. <laughs> Thank you guys again so much for tuning in. Love and light. Remember, there is a, full, a new moon. That is coming up on Sunday. Set your intentions. Yep. Take the energy from it so you can help be the best version of yourself. There you go. Buy a uni egg. So come buy the uni egg before the new moon and so. Yes, <laughs> Come wine out on the sea. Come <coughs> wine out. <coughs> Take care, guys. Love and light. <laughs> <laughs>